Oh, I know. It's so hot. This summer feels like it's never going to end. Hi, Anna. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize you're on the phone. Who are you talking to? It's Ariel. We're just so hot. It's just... It's hot. It's very, very hot. <gasps> I know. We should have a pool party. Or I could just freeze stuff. No, 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 no. Pool party. A pool party would be so awesome. Oh my goodness, I'm going to call all of the princesses and let them know. And we're going, we, we're having a pool party. Fine. Okay. I could have just frozen stuff. No, that's what I'm good at. Freezing, making things cold, make things not hot. But anyway, we'll have a pool party. Awesome. Well, here we are at the Heart Lake Pool. In fact, both of the Heart Lake Pools joined together to make this poolside bonanza. And the first princess to arrive is, of course, Anna, because she's super duper hot. And Kristoff has delivered her. He's going to pick her up later on today. He's such a good fellow. And it looks so, oh, so inviting and refreshing. Look at all that cool water. But before you can go for a swim, you need to put on your swimming costume. So what swimmers are we going to put on Anna? So let's see. Let's put her in the change cubicle and let's see. Oh, what a lovely sarong. So obviously her top is absolutely perfect to go swimming in. It's a bit of a strapless number and she's now properly attired on the bottom, ready to go for a swim. But before she goes for a swim, she must apply sunscreen all over because look at that fair skin. In fact, it doesn't matter how light or dark your skin is, you need to put on sunscreen. It is so, so important if you're going to be out in the sun. Now who's coming now? It's Elsa. Oh, she's decided to join the party after all, and Marshmallow gave her a wonderful lift to the pool. Uh, I can see that Anna is just thrilled that Elsa is here. So Elsa, it's time for you to put on some swimmers into the change room and... Looks like she's changed. Oh, very fancy swimsuit. That looks gorgeous. All right, I think you're both ready. If you can come over here and put some sunscreen on, I can see the next princess arriving. It's Cinderella in her carriage. I hope it's not gonna turn into a pumpkin. I don't think it is. It's nowhere near midnight. Hi, Cinderella. Would you like to put your swimmers on? The more people are here, the sooner everyone gets here, the sooner we can all go for a swim and cool down. So in she goes and... Let's see, what's Cinderella got? Are you coming out? Oh, that is such a bubbly, wonderful swimsuit. Oh, look at that temporary tattoo that she's got on her shoulder there. That looks absolutely marvelous. Belle, of course, walked because she likes to get the exercise. She likes the open air and she's brought a book. I wonder if she's gonna actually do any swimming today. Looks like she's gonna change into her swimmers, so that's something. Let's see if we can actually fit her into the change room in her ball gown. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. Here we go. Now she's changed. <gasps> and she looks resplendent in green. So summery. Oh, you look so fresh and cool now. Oh, and sunglasses. Well, oh, actually, what have you forgotten? Are you coming back? Oh, she forgot her book, of course. You must never go anywhere without a book. <laughs> oh, and I just saw the magic carpet fly by. Is carpet coming back? It is, and it's going to deliver Jasmine. Hi, Jasmine. All right, there goes Carpet. All right, Jasmine, have you brought your swimmers? I hope so. Let's see. All right, some swimmers for Jasmine. Oh, there we go. She looks all fresh and summery. She's ready. I hope all these girls are putting sunscreen on over here. They're currently even standing out in the sun. Oh, Ariel's arrived in her dolphin carriage. <laughs> This is Ariel as a princess, Ariel. Ariel, would you like to get changed? Not in there? No? You've brought your own change room. <laughs> Let's see. The magical change room. All right. On your hop then. And if you could get ready to swim too. Into your swimmers. Oh, of course you don't have swimmers. You're a mermaid. Into your mermaid tail then. Oh, you look lovely in pink today. Oh, look at that. And she's got pink sunglasses on. Very good for protecting her eyes. Oh, we've got quite a few princesses here now, but we're still waiting on some more. Oh, here comes Moana. What on earth is Maui doing? Could you not have, you know, traveled as, a, as an eagle or something and brought her flying? No, 
All right, it was nice of Maui to drop her off anyway. All right, in to the magical changing room. Let's see what Swimmers Moana has. Oh, very nice. Oh, that's wonderful. See, she didn't even need to change her bottom because she was already all sarongd up. So she's now just got a little top on, ready to go swimming. Well, this is starting to look very good. We've got lots of very hot princesses here, ready to get in the pool and get nice and cool. Now, who's coming next? <gasps> it's Rapunzel. Oh, and Maximus has brought Rapunzel. Maximus is concerned for her welfare, but she's going to be fine. She's here with all the other princesses. She'll be super safe. Okay, Rapunzel, into the magical underwater change room. And let's get your swimwear on. Wonderful, she looks so tropical now. And the flowers around her neck match the flowers in her hair. <laughs> it's the last two princesses to arrive. And Aurora is asleep again, so Merida is driving her here in the taxi. Is Aurora going to wake up, do you think, to actually go for a swim, maybe, now that Merida has dropped her on the ground? Are you awake yet? I think we've knocked everyone over. <laughs> They've all caught Aurora's sleeping, sleeping magic. All right, let's see if we can get Aurora into her swimwear. And she's awake and she's ready to swim. And Merida is thrilled because she doesn't want to have to carry her around anymore. <laughs> Wonderful. All right, Aurora, if you can come over here, you might need to put on some sunscreen too. And Merida is ready to get changed and get in that pool. Wonderful. She's ready. They're all ready. Can we please start this pool party then? Can we? Would you all stop standing around and talking and get in the pool? Oh no, hold on. Oh my goodness. Ursula and Maleficent have just arrived. They're really hot too. And they promise they're not going to cause any trouble. No trouble at all. So as long as they don't try to curse anyone, put any magic spells on anyone, or feed anyone any poisoned apples, we can all get along A-OK -okay here. All right. Cinderella is first into the pool and splash! She's in! <laughs> All right, here we go. Ariel's coming in too. Oh, this is wonderful. And Anna, she's been waiting for this all summer. What a fabulous idea this was. And Elsa's not getting in. She's really not. She's not hot. She's always cold. So she's going to just lay out here, have a nice drink. And the girls are in here having a wonderful time in the pool. And Aurora seems to be asleep again on that floating little bed there, but oh, look at Merida. Merida is going to splash some water down on her. <laughs> oh dear, they can get so cheeky, these princesses. And Ursula's having a nice time in the hot tub with a slice of watermelon. Oh, look at that. See, they all can get along if they just play nicely. And... Oh, look at that. Belle's not swimming either. She's up here on the lifeguard station reading a book. So she's not really being the most effective of lifeguards because you're supposed to be watching the people in the pool, but I'm sure they'll be okay. <laughs> and over here in the spa, Cinderella and Maleficent are having a bit of a chat. I wonder what they're talking about. Maleficent is having a delicious ice cream, so she couldn't possibly be cross or want to curse anybody. And Kristoff has come back a little bit early, but he's going to sit down. He's going to read the magazine, read that newspaper while he waits for Anna to be finished. Gosh, he's such a nice guy. But look at this, it is still so hot that the princesses have asked Elsa to cool it down even further with her ice magic and look, she's made it snow. Oh, it's going to be really chilly now. And there are ice sculptures everywhere. Maleficent has got an ice, ice cream. <laughs> oh my goodness me. And oh, fantastic, we're ready. Aurora is going to have the best ice drink ever. <gasps> Look at that ice sculpture drink. That looks amazing. Yes, I think it's quite cold enough now. It's time to lay a bit off on the snow, Elsa. <laughs> so we're going to 
going to leave them there to their pool party at the moment. And uh, we'll come back and visit them another time. But in the meantime, please make sure that you subscribe and click the little bell. That way you get notified when new videos go up. Give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Which swimming costume did you like the best? And I'll see you with a new video very, very soon.